China's creepy annexation, decoding the strategic play in fishing law enforcement. Introduction Welcome back to Capture the Intelligence, where we dissect global events with a keen eye for geopolitical strategy. Today we're delving into a recent development that has sent ripples through the Taiwan Strait. China's deployment of fishery law enforcement vessels in the waters surrounding Kinmen Island. An expert commentator provides a nuanced analysis of this seemingly mundane move, revealing a deeper strategic intent that could reshape the regional balance of power. So buckle up and prepare to navigate the murky depths of China's calculated actions. China's fishing fleet, a stealthy invasion on February 25, 2024, the Fujian Ocean and Fishery Law Enforcement Headquarters dispatched two fishery patrol boats to the waters near Kinmen, an island controlled by Taiwan. This seemingly innocuous action, however, carries significant implications as the commentator Astutely points out, unlike Coast Guard vessels, which primarily focus on border security and deterring foreign incursions, fishery law enforcement boats have a specific mandate to regulate fishing activities and enforce fishing laws. By deploying these vessels, China is effectively asserting its authority over the waters around Kinmen, a clear departure from the previous focus on maritime law enforcement. Implications for Taiwan's sovereignty and the livelihood. Of its fishermen, the introduction of fishery law enforcement in these contested waters has far-reaching consequences. Firstly, it undermines Taiwan's sovereignty over its surrounding waters. Previously, Taiwanese fishermen could operate in these areas with permits issued by the Taiwanese government. However, with China's fishery patrols in place, Taiwanese fishermen risk fines, arrests, or even asset seizures if they continue fishing without Chinese permits. Secondly. This move threatens the livelihoods of Kinmen's fishing communities. Many families in Kinmen rely on fishing for their sustenance and income. By asserting control over fishing rights, China can effectively strangle the local economy, compelling fishermen to seek permits from Chinese authorities. This would not only erode Taiwan's authority but also create a sense of dependency on China, further tightening its grip on the region. A strategic power play with regional ramifications. Experts says to. Observed that China's fishing law enforcement strategy is not limited to Taiwan. It's a carefully orchestrated move with broader regional implications. By establishing a precedent of asserting fishing rights in disputed waters, China can gradually expand its control over the Taiwan Strait and even the East China Sea. This strategy has the potential to ignite tensions with Japan, which has substantial fishing interests in the region. China's encroachment into these waters. Could lead to conflicts between Chinese and Japanese fishing vessels escalating into diplomatic disputes. Conclusion: A calculated move with far-reaching consequences. In conclusion, China's deployment of fishery law enforcement vessels near Kinmen is a calculated move with far-reaching consequences. It's an attempt to undermine Taiwan's sovereignty, erode its control over its surrounding waters, and create economic leverage over Kinmen's fishing communities. Moreover. However, it sets a dangerous precedent for China's future actions in the region, potentially leading to conflicts with Japan and further destabilizing the already tense geopolitical landscape. If you found this video insightful, be sure to like, share, and smash that subscribe button. Stay tuned for the latest current affairs on the Capture the Intelligence channel, where we bring you in-depth analysis of global events with a focus on geopolitical strategy. Together, let's navigate the. Complexities of the modern world and uncover the hidden truths that shape our interconnected planet.